Hi guys, GoTroller team here. As you can see, we're playing with our new range controller. It works for iOS and Android. I'm going to quickly show you how it works. See if I can... Uh, let's just throw a quick... Uh, uh, yeah, I got I don't know, that much. Well, I've got one kill. Hi right, guys, go to the team here, we're back. This is our 3-in-1 controller, it works for um, for PC, Android and iOS. And we've got an iOS device here, iPhone 11. So let's start. First thing first guys, see if it's on, as you can see controller is on. So what you must first do is click the iOS button, you just click it and then it's connected. You can just hold it in, start flickering, you know it's you now part of the iOS um, um, chipset. So as you can see it's been working now, so first thing first, check your settings, see if it's uh, picking up your Bluetooth. As you can see I'm starting this thing from scratch, you click on your device, you wait for it to pair, it pairs, there you go. Very important, so you open up your game, um, let's go to Call of Duty, i quickly open it up for you. Just going to quickly pause the video so it's not that too long. Hi guys, go to the team here, as you can see we're back. Just uh, waiting for the game to load. So as you can see my controller is already working but I'm going to start from scratch for you to show you how it works. So very important, first take a uh, screenshot of your game. Oh man, always a... No. There you go, took a screenshot. What you then do is you can go out of your game because the game is not um, irrelevant to what you have to do. I'm just gonna quickly get out of the game a few quickly. Um, okay, so important. We took a screenshot. So what is important now is to open up your app you need to download. As you can see it shows connected. That's what is important. There's all your games. It's been pre-configured if you want to play any other games. Or you can always just um, put your own uh, keys on mm. what you want to play. So what do you do is, there's that icon, so what do you do is you click um, on the icon, it will basically show up already a uh, picture of what I've got. You go to, you click on the photo, you say choose picture, you go to your screenshots you just took now, and that's mine. As you can see my keys are already configured, but what do you do is you start from scratch, you say new, as you can see there's everything is gone. So how it works is you press your left toggle, take it to, you drag it to there. You press it, there's two settings, normal rocker, that's the one you have to use, it doesn't matter really, but just keep it on the maximum. You don't work on the speed setting really, normal rocker is the one you need, press OK, you press this one, there's a right button, you go here, you press it. You don't use a normal rocker, you use a perspective, the speed setting one, that, um, that depends on what your sensitivity want to be, 1, 2, 3, 4. I choose it one, it works perfect for me. Um, if I want to use the, I use, this is my configuration, so I use this one to swap my weapons. Um, if I want to use to um, load ammo, that one. If I use my grenade, I use this one. Just quickly gonna drag it there for you. If I want to crouch, I use this one. For jump, I use this one. Um, for my auto fire or my fire, I use this one. This is the middle one. And then these three buttons here, I press this one normally. And I choose this one. And I press this one. And as you can see, all the keys are configured for this controller. It works perfectly. I'm going to quickly save. That's been important. It shows it's successfully saved. Now you can go into a game. Keep your app always open. Click to Call of Duty as the game. I'm just going to quickly pause the game. Oh, let, okay, let me uh, not pause it so that you can see it's not a scam or anything. But we did configure the controller. As you can see, it's a very nice controller. It's durable, it works perfectly. I'm just going to conf confirm here. Put in my settings. Let's see if I have got only one minute left on my phone, and my phone is full. So let me see if I can get a quick one minute video for you guys. So you play this game. 
I like Kilos. Kilos is my favorite map. It's, it's I know all the the ins and outs now. Okay, so as you can see, configured. I can switch. I can. Um, here's my um, grenade. Yeah, from a grenade. No, I don't want to go throw it. It doesn't matter. Oh, I actually used the wrong button. I actually wanted this one. So you can quickly go out. So I'm going to quickly show you what it can do. Oh, I don't have much time. So, don't worry guys. I'm just going to play the game. So you, I didn't configure now my, um, my rocket launcher. Well, to swap. Did I say swap this one? I think I didn't choose that one. That's a problem. Anyway, guys, I only have these now. So I have to work with this now. So let me throw my grenade. There you go. It's gonna be difficult now too. As you can see. Easy guys, thanks for watching. If you want this controller, buy it. It's an awesome controller. As you can see, it's easy to configure my controls. You can play any game, Fortnite, Asphalt, any game you want to play, PUBG. You just configure your controllers. You can see I can jump, I can crouch, I can shoot, but I didn't uh, configure my rock launch. But that's not an issue. That's easy to configure. That's how I showed you guys. Thanks, guys.